know, all the times I've been coming down here, I've never had a chance to spend the day with Aaron's dad, Jimmy. Years to figure out that when the water dropped, they would also back up 10 miles just as easily as going forward 10 miles. Burrowing down in the current, you really put up a great fight in light gear. It's a nice light combo we're using. We're using it to their full advantage in the current. It's a nice fish. Downstream from where the famous Sacramento River and the famous Feather River are joining up. It's really streamy run here. Exactly. Very streamy nice run. Nice fish, Al. Thanks, Aaron. Man. Yeah, got I got one going too right now. Oh. There, you go. You got it. there he is. Fish off. Ooh, that might be a better fish. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. We found them, baby. <laughs> we found them again. All right. Get this one in quick because they're all over fish. Ah, little guy, not even a keeper. So what we got going on here is it's something that Aaron had actually mentioned to Jimmy yesterday. That they had a feeling that these fish were gonna start backing out of this river in just a matter of time, and that's exactly what happened. There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh, oh, oh. Eat it. What's going on there? Big striper down here trying to eat my little minnow. That minnow is trying to escape. And we can feel the whole thing happening thanks to the braided line. <laughs> Direct drive with the braided line. The minnow is too lively. We escaped. Oh, there it, it is. is. On the jig. Big fish. That was a hook set, too. Yeah. That was the best hook set I've seen in some time. It went kick. When they go kick. The secret to our success here. today was the father and son knowledge, bouncing ideas off each other, old hot spots, let's try this, and it led us yeah, right into into where the fish drop. were at. You know how hard it is to teach somebody that? It's very hard. Because they never keep the line tight enough. Guy, but another little guy. Okay. Okay. Calm down, I'm not going to hurt you. Bottom 30. That jig is Rockus Moranus, striped bass. <laughs> We were so lucky today, Dennis and I had with us Aaron's pop, Jimmy. So between the two of them, father and son team, they have over 60 years of combined of guiding on this river system here. So we are absolutely overwhelmed with the fantastic knowledge that was available to us today. It's over the four mark. There you go. See? There it is. That's dinner. All right. Over the four, what's it? This one's going to be called the Oh, that one's bigger. Oh, is that on the jig? Oh, on the jig oh. and the minnow. Double hookup. Yeah. Okay. Patient today. 